erythema toxicum neonatorum. It is a common pustular rash that is seen in newborns. Rather interestingly, extensive cases are rare in preterm infants. It usually appears between 24 to 72 hours of life. Having said that, it may be present at birth. It presents with small whitish or yellowish papules with an erythematous halo. These papules, however, quickly become sterile pustules. The rash is most commonly found on the face, trunk, and proximal extremities. The rash migrates, disappearing and reappearing on different parts of the body, except on the palms and soles which are spared. The diagnosis is usually made clinically via visual recognition of the rash. It is important to differentiate these lesions from an infection. When in doubt, a right or gram stain can be performed on the contents of the lesion. With erythema toxicum neonatorum, only azenophils are present. No treatment is necessary. In fact, some creams and lotions can actually worsen the rash. Spontaneous resolution usually occurs within a week. However, the rash may reoccur up to the age of 3 months. I hope you found this lecture to be helpful and worth your time. Please feel free and very welcome to leave a comment or suggestion below. And if you like this video, please hit subscribe and check out some of the other videos in this channel.